You know what it is. Let's go fishing. See if we can get off of this real struggle bus. See if we can get on our soon to be PB peacock bass. I wanna pull a big guy out. Pause. What I noticed from how much more subtle the last bite was and how the bait is sitting on the hook is that I needed something with a shorter profile to be able to get the hook in the mouth. What they were doing was striking my lure and only getting the tail end. So when I would set the hook, I'd just be pulling it right out of their mouth. Got him. I got him. Oh man. Oh man, PB. New PB, PB Peacock. Just caught it. No more struggle bus, we're off the bus. Check out how that bass tore my crawfish bait up. Spit it and he bit my shit off. The jerk bait was just scaring all the fish, even the big ones.
Oh, I got him. Oh, I got him. Oh, I got him. Learning from how I was fighting the big peacock earlier in the video, you see me go to the side to fight him sideways. I didn't want him to have an opportunity to jump and spit my hook. Oh, I got him. Oh, I got him. Oh man, what a fight. We caught him, new PB. Five pound peacock. Yeah, I'm actually longboarding. How you doing? Don't say hi back, that's fine. Yeah, it's mid-February. We saw some peacock spawning and um, decided to gear up. So I had to slow it down today and uh, get on that bed. We did it. We pulled out a new PB peacock. Let's go. Eating baby, even though we catch and release, we don't eat the fish, but we're eating baby, yeah!